I've been to Washington, D.C. a couple times before. When I came with my family for the first time, uh, I was only 12, 13 years old. We came by to see the Vietnam Veterans Memorial. And walking by, I really didn't understand what it meant at the time, but I do remember seeing my, my family member's name on that wall. So here, when I was there last night, I wanted to uh, find his name again. And uh, being here in front of the Iwo Jima Memorial, uh, on my, my father's side, my great great uncle, uh, he was 17 years, no, 16 years old when World War II started. Told his mother that if she didn't sign his papers, he was gonna lie about his age and join anyways. And so she ended up signing his papers, he went off. And he was killed on Iwo Jima on the first day. He was part of the first wave. He was, in, he was a hero. We don't know too much, at least I don't, what he actually did on, on that, that island. But after reading Flags of Our Fathers and other great books and meeting with veterans, he, he did amazing things. He was a hero. And we have a letter from his mother written in Polish because we're a Polish family. And she beat herself up every day because she signed those those documents. She thought that it was her fault, even though it wasn't. And so it, everyone has people like that in their family, it, all these amazing people. And it, if you don't, we're all Americans, so we're all part of that, that greater family. It just means a lot to be here.